big breaths. Because we got this. We got stuff to do. You may be seated. seated. Marriage. <laughs> that blessed arrangement. That dream. Within a dream. Just kidding. I've been wanting to do that. <laughs> but the truth is, I don't know the first thing about marriage. And it only seems right that someone who is married, that someone with a marriage full of love and passion, humor and patience, a marriage full of the best parts of what love is, marries you today. Somebody who is legally authorized to marry you. <laughs> Tom Brady, come on. Oh. It's Cam Newton. That's for you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so it only makes sense that somebody who has this experience ushers you into this next phase. And that somebody is Mrs. Irwin. And uh, Sandy and Sean have written their own vows today. You guys ready? I'm ready. Okay. Sandy, my love, I pledge to you first and foremost to love you always, unconditionally, with an unfaltering loyalty, openness, and honesty. My darling Sean, it is a privilege to stand here at the top of the world with all of our dear friends and family and promise to love you completely today as I did yesterday, as I will tomorrow, and through all our future days. I promise to be there for you, to be the one you can always count on, the one you never hesitate to ask anything for, to be your ever dependable rock. I give you my heart, my time, my energy, my devotion, and my promise to walk hand in hand by your side through all life brings us. I promise to be your companion in adventure. I commit to living life to its fullest, traveling near and far with you, and embracing the zest that you have for life and people and music and culture and the beauty found in nature like what surrounds us all here today. I have to cheat now. <laughs> I promise to support and believe in you, to accept you and love you as you are now and as the man you are yet to become. I promise in the re to respect and support who you are, all of your dreams and your passions, your ambitions and goals, your career and your personal growth, and to commit to care for you along our journey, including the challenges and obstacles that we may face. I promise to be your lover, your confidant, your friend, your partner in all things, your greatest fan. I will continue to provide you with laughter, including laughing at myself, <laughs> and hopefully bring the lighter side of life to you and hopefully some rays of sunshine on the grayer, cloudier days. Okay, this is where I really need help. <laughs> this one's a tough one. I promise to listen to you with an open heart, to be kind, faithful, and loyal. I promise to share with you, be honest with you, and depend on you as my support, even when I know I can do it myself. <laughs> <laughs> I promise to work through difficulties, to change and adapt when needed, and to apologize, mm -hmm. and to hopefully make myself a better man, to always achieve, making to achieve a, a most happy and fulfilling life together. I promise to enjoy the good times, the little things and the big things, and I promise to have patience and faith in us through the difficult times. I promise to continue to build a strong foundation with you. I promise to choose love, and I promise to choose us. I promise to always honor and respect you and never take you for granted, because how could I? Every day I'm reminded how lucky I am. I met and quickly fell in love with the most remarkable woman. You are so kind and empathetic and warmly compassionate. You are a fresh, fun, happy, joyous spirit. You are endlessly interesting and fascinating and astute. You are so, so beautiful with your deep, soulful eyes and even deeper in your brilliance and even deeper in the way that you love me. It's easy to make all these pledges to honor and respect you, to care for you, support you, to be loyal and honest, to have a lifetime of, of adventure and laughter. 
and to always love you. I love you. All right, well, Sandy and Sean, the promises you have made are today are the groundwork for, work for which your marriage will grow and blossom. Do you have your rings? Mm -hmm. Sean, as you place the ring on her finger, you can say in the... I don't even know what you're supposed to say. I'm going to have you repeat after me. That's what I'm going to have you do. Okay. <laughs> okay, you ready? I'm ready. Okay. Sandy, as I give you this ring. Sandy, as I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love for you. As a symbol of my love for you. Let it be a reminder. Let it be a reminder. That I am always by your side. That I am always by your side. As your faithful partner. As your faithful partner. And as you place the ring on his finger, you'll okay. say, repeat after me. Okay. Sean, I give you this ring. Sean, I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love for you. As a symbol of my love for you. Let it be a reminder. Let it be a reminder. That I am always by your side. That I'm always by your side. As your faithful partner. As your faithful partner. Well, then by the power vested in me, I now, for the first time, pronounce you married. Sean, you may kiss your bride, or is it Sandy, you can kiss your groom? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Friends and family, now it's a little bit I've waiting for you to take out your phones, get them ready. Wish some uh, well wishes for the bride and the groom. Sandy and Sean, I love you guys so much, and I don't think either of you guys could have seen just how much you guys could be perfect for each other. And I just think you guys are going to be perfect. Sean, welcome to the family. You belong exactly where you are within our family. We love you. I am so, so touched and so happy that you are together. You are meant to be together, and I couldn't be happier. And my wishes for you are all the best. You are going to be a fantastic family group and you're going to be just doing amazing things together. And I, I can tell you're going to be so supportive and loving of each other and I just love you to pieces, both of you. 
It's just a wonderful thing to have together the two families and I just couldn't be any happier. I just wish you more of the same. I don't have anything extra to say, just since I've met Sean and since I've seen Sandy with Sean, since I've seen you together, it's just been such a sweet thing to be a part of and to witness. And I just wish you more of the same. Just keep it up. Um, you guys just taking care of each other. You take care of us and we love you very much. Sean and Sandy, congratulations. I'm so happy for both of you. I'm excited to expand my family to your Sean. That says a lot, as you know. And Sandy, I'm so happy you found your one. Congratulations. Sandy, I just met you less than a year ago and it feels like I've known you my entire life. I cannot picture my reality without you. And you are the perfect compliment to Sean. Sean, you are the best brother in the world. I love you so, so much. You consume a huge space in my heart, both of you. And honestly, thank you for expanding my mind that there really is true love out there. I love you guys. I honestly can't say to many kind things for Sandy and Sean. Like, they're just the best people that you'll ever come across in a lifetime. And that means that they're going to have the best time together. So I see how they honor each other um, and how they just really validate and respect one another and think it's the most beautiful thing. So I'm so happy for Sandy and I'm so happy that Sean is with me. I am so freaking excited for you. I can't even stand it. Like I wish nothing but the best and love and happiness and for eternity. I love you guys. Very excited for you guys. It's awesome. We're happy for you. Love you.